Just kind of picking away at uh, getting all these row units back on the planter and uh, figuring out some vacuum uh, lines too because that was kind of my concern just the way with the fold on the stacker and stuff like that but I think I got it figured out uh, main, so mainly on this here I just waiting for some pieces from uh, the John Deere dealer here in Tractor um, but you can see what I'm trying to accomplish over here uh, the fan will be mounted there on this bracket and then uh, it will probably come out to about here we'll just go with some flexible holes to connect onto this line here and then this T will have some flex line that goes all the way over to the wings uh, and will connect uh, in this area for the wings so got the vacuum kind of figured out which uh, was something I was worried about um, now it's just going to try to be figuring out how to get all the uh, electronic components put on and kind of keep the wiring out of, out of the way uh, and uh, so I might have to spend some time just folding it and unfolding it to make sure nothing gets caught up but uh, I think today we'll just keep going at uh, trying to finalize getting all these row units on I can all get them all on but one I'm still waiting for a couple of u-bolts uh, the one thing that I do have to figure out too is because uh, I told you before I have the uh, delta force which is a hydraulic downforce control I do have to get hydraulic lines out to the wings um, as it folds so that's another thing I got figured out is how to run hydraulic lines uh, wiring harnesses vacuum hose and I think probably liquid starter lines all out to the wings without them getting kind of caught up or impeded by the folding mechanism of the stacker bar so kind of just gonna have to scratch my head a bit on that but uh, uh, so far coming along pretty good and hopefully uh, we can get it wrapped up here in the next week major stuff in a week hopefully I might have some fine-tuning yet I gotta do but uh, that's kind of my hope So, um, still trying to figure this out. We're getting a little farther ahead. Apparently, it uh, pays to look in the box of extras that they send with the Alari because uh, I got these brackets I found in the box and these U bolts, which uh, go nicely like that. As you can see, my fancy work platform. Um, so this is what the bracket with the U-bolt on it looks like um, here. You can kind of see it's made from flexi hose. So when it's folded down up here at the top, there's some slack. But when it's not folded, or when it's folded up like this, it's caught on this little thing here. If I take it off, it's not too bad. I just don't know what to do. Cause I gotta make sure that there's uh, basically enough, uh, enough room for stuff to bend up there, to fold and be folded. But when it folds out, there's kind of a, quite a bit of surplus. So still scratching my head. I'll get in close though. I think it's just a matter of maybe making a bracket I can put on the bolts here that uh, will help just hold some of that slack up um, so that uh, it's not kind of falling down where it shouldn't be. But uh, yeah, getting there. <laughs> 